Barely a day after the government imposed a lockdown on the five counties, business entities have laid off employees as they scaled down operations in line with the new order. But the transport sector was booming with business as they capitalized on the confusion created by the new measures to make a killing. Hassan Mugambi with the details. Nairobi, the country's main economic hub smack in the middle of the five counties termed as infected zone, now reeling from the effects of the new lockdown measures. Most businesses bearing the brunt of the order. The most affected being the hotel industry. Owners of eateries such as this one saying the revised protocol has paralyzed their operations. <laughs> They have been left with no choice, but also revised their staff numbers downwards. The country's coastal hotel industry is not spared either, with massive cancellations reported ahead of Easter holidays. We are at 70 percent as at now. We are projecting to get 10 more percent next week uh, because of the last minute nature of a lot of our plans. But then we have we began receiving cancellations yesterday, and therefore we are talking about um, 60% cancellation. Uh, we are left with 10% uh, projections for the Easter. We'll do with what we'd have to do. The long-distance public transport service, which ply inter-county, were also caught off guard. Businesses grinding to a halt. <laughs> learning institutions have also moved to close shop for physical learning. In an internal memo seen by Citizen TV, Moi University has suspended face-to-face -face teaching and learning activities in all campuses, with the exception of the College of Health Sciences. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV.